G'day guys, Greg here. Well today I'm going to show you how to make something, a nice sweet little treat called a cinnamon pinwheel. Now these are really easy and they taste like donuts, so what could be better? Now you're not supposed to eat them on their own, even though you can. They go great with ice creams, mousse, sorbets or other creamy desserts. Just add some of that to the dessert and mwah. Anyway, let's get started. So what you're going to need is a sheet of puff pastry, about two teaspoons of ground cinnamon, a quarter of a cup of caster sugar or some extra fine sugar, and an egg. The first thing we're going to do is preheat that oven. It's going to be nice and hot one, about 220 degrees Celsius or 425 Fahrenheit. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is get this sugar and the cinnamon and mix that in together. I'm then going to put an egg in here and just beat that. Now onto a nice flat surface, I'm just going to sprinkle some flour just so the puff pastry doesn't stick there. So now I've got the puff pastry down, I'm going to sprinkle half the sugar and cinnamon mix over the top. Now what I'm going to do is get a rolling pin and just roll that in. Once you've done that, we're just going to get some this egg and we're going to spread the egg over the top this puff pastry. It's very handy having a brush I tell you. Try doing this with your hands. Believe me, I've done it before. Now once you've done that we're going to add the rest of the sugar and cinnamon mix. Actually don't put the rest of the sugar on, save some because we're going to sprinkle some over the top at the end. And now what we're going to do is just loosely roll this up. Don't want to roll it too tight you want it, that puff pastry to expand. We're just going to coat this in the leftover egg mix so it sticks down nicely. Just pat that down. Now with a nice sharp knife I'm just going to cut this into about one centimeter segments which we are then going to put onto some baking paper. Okay, well once the oven's at the desired temperature, we're going to stick these in the oven. And cook them for about 10 minutes until they're golden brown. Rightio, well that's the 10 minutes done. Let's take a look at these. Oh yeah, they look great. Okay, I'm not going to be so silly this time. I'm going to transfer them straight onto this tray here. Oh no! Ah! Maybe I am just silly. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to put them on this cooling rack and just sprinkle the sugar over the top here. Now I've just turned these over. I'm just going to put some of this sugar cinnamon mix on the other side as well. Right, well I can't wait to give these a go. Let's see what they taste like. A little bit doughy. Anyway, thanks for watching. Remember to subscribe for more. And I'll see you next time right here on Greg's Kitchen. Oh yeah, this is Greg's Kitchen.